Hello everybody, it's Captain Thief, June 7th, Daily Dungeon. I betcha it's going to be Goat Person and Vicious Gauntlet, right? Nope, Ick Swamp with Gorgon. Okay, cool. Cool. I was just expecting some Goat Person action, that's all, that's all. Um, let's see, Gorgon, we want to... I think... I think we region fight with Gorgon, pretty much. So what helps with that? Well, the Apothecary, I don't... I'm going to see that helping. The Shop Scroll, I kind of like. Tiki Tuki's alright too, but Gorgon's not really a class that kills things in one hit, so I don't really see that working so much with that piety penalty upon first hit. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Attack boosters, yes, attack boosters are more important for Gorgon because they have minus 50% bonus damage, and that's a huge deal because at minus 50% bonus damage, it means half your damage. You lose more damage losing 50% bonus damage than you do gaining 50%. You see what I mean? Yeah, something like that. The Perseverance Badge, it, that also kind of helps fix this. I mean, I would regularly love my extra mana boosters, but not today. Let's bet on boss. I'm feeling a little overconfidence. Overconfidence is a slow and insidious demise. Okay, um, enough Darkest Dungeons. That game just got massively updated, and I don't know what I'm going to do about that. Oh, hey, wait, what? So let's just go ahead and drop the shop screw right there. War garble. Hey, the war garble. That actually really helps with my region fighting skills. And the gloves of mice. Yeah, well, let's already spend all our money as soon as we get in here. Um, I see Yehora. Yehora. If I can get there. Oh, and I can. You want to know how? You really want to know how? Watch. Watch. Awesome, isn't it? All right, Yehora. Don't mess me up. Don't mess me over. Don't mess me down. Um. I could recycle the weight what and pick up the other weight what, but then I'd be like, wait, what? Okay, we have Indus Wall, so let's let's break some waves into places. And I don't have I'm a wall, so that's not something I can really do. Um, let's see if I can get to petition. That would be great. Oh hey, Hotma, that's an even better use of my MP, I think. Ah, uh, biceps. I, I just pick, pick, picked up everything I possibly could, didn't I? Um, tell you what. We'll break this and just keep on kind of exploring. Did I get hit by anything yet from Yehora? No. No, I did not. Okay, good. Good. Um, yeah, I'm still only at three base damage. Not the best thing in the world. Oh, and I'm cursed. Which means all this physical resist will go for nothing. Um, and also I should probably be... You know, switching places with people, gaining piety, maybe moving plants out of the way. And, you know, I can totally kill plants. It's destroyed my physical resist, but my physical resist wasn't helping anyway. So why destroy plants? Well, regular plants. The answer is so that way I have room to move, you know, enemies into. So, you know, this, this is my plan. Let's go and move this guy. Yeah, yeah, something like that. And we'll just kind of head this way. Gorgons are actually a lot easier for a Gorgon to kill. Oh, hey, I got hit by you, did I? He's just a little too hard for me to kill, though. So, you know, we'll let him go this time. This time. And I'm cursed, so, you know, I'm, I'm not, that's not helping there, either. Oh, there's no way I can kill anybody in one hit. To remove this dang curse. Alright, whatever. That's fine. Oh, hey, biceps would actually really help with our minus base damage thing going on here. So, let's go ahead and get rid of this white what for a minute. Pick up this one. And use biceps. Okay, is that much better? On damage? It is. But the weakening blow kind of scares me. Um, so we'll just go ahead and kill this guy. And yes, we are poisoned by um, naturalness. And I just got poisoned. Cool. Cool. You know, I wanted that. No, really, I did. I'm gonna have to drink a potion just to get rid of it. Aren't I? Aren't I? Well, maybe. Maybe. Let's, let's just go ahead and do that. I, I, I don't want to think about it too long. Okay. Oh, a mana booster. And the store. Dragon kind of sorry. Is he an arrogance long enough? Mammal will prepare to be humbled by the power of the reptilian agents the firstborn. Pretty tough guy, especially since he's got a magic attack. And all I have is this physical resistance. We'll see about that. Um, since I turned this thing into stone, let's go ahead and break it just so... Oh, hey. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. All right. Biceps up. Um, can't afford, you know, what I'm after just yet. Just yet. 
But what I can do is then pick up the wait what? Um, what was I doing? I'm gonna have to recycle something, unfortunately. Actually, since he's burning, I can just grab darkness and he won't be able to regenerate at all. Even though he's got poison, yeah, look at that, poison five, nine, nine, nine tiles. It's just not gonna work for him. It just ain't. We'll see about using the wit wet later. All right, even more, a little bit of bonus damage there, yes. Let's use our Indus wall to maybe get through here. Thanks for stealing some of my health, jerk. Oh, we got enough for a petition. Let's uh, let's do it. Boom. No more punishments for me, thankfully. And according to Lacat, actually, if you get petition and you're a goat person, guess what? You don't have to worry so much about uh, losing it whenever you switch deities. So yeah, that, that, great great going, Lacat. Excellent work. Excellent detective work. Um, I can't poison the undead, but I can light them on fire, which is almost just as good. So, let's go ahead and grab some health, and grab some more health, and finish him off. And it actually kind of really stinks being mana burned in this situation that I'm in. So, yeah, let's uh, break statues where we make them. I don't want them to stay around too long. Oh, a level 2 Gorgon. That actually seems like a good idea to me. Let's, uh, let's consider it. Let's consider it. Um, I don't have enough money for another Indus wall. Fine. So now I just need to consider the best way of killing her, or, you know, the best way of using my MP, actually. Because I like the use of the Hauptna, but I also kind of like the idea of, you know, adding some biceps to this whole game. So let's do that. And we'll smack her. And then we'll poison her and burn her, so, you know, this will kind of work out a little bit in our favor. And we'll just, in general, region fight her, okay? It kind of works. Um, I probably should have biceps there, but whatever. I mean, we're doing fine. We're doing great. Biceps again. Uh, that actually didn't help. Because it's not going to make a difference of a, an entire hit. And I win because my death gaze is killing her. And that's because I have 10% of that stuff. 15% actually, okay, good. Good on me. Turn her into stone. Break her statue. Haha. -ha. You know, if I remember right, in F Final Fantasy X, you could uh, build kind of a relationship meter between characters. And the way to destroy that meter the quickest, if you really wanted to, was to turn one of them into stone and then hit one of the, and then have one of the characters hit that first character. And that kind of did it? I don't remember. Anyway, let's just keep on going with this. I'm I'm having I'm having fun. Not that I've played a whole lot of Final Fantasy X. It's an alright game. Um 15% of 27. I don't have that. Who said I had that? Nobody. I can't kill enemies to get them out of the way, by the way, because they turn into statues. Alright, this will barely work because of the burning stacks and the were garble. And the fact that she's now stone. Um, see? Stone. Um, 20, that means I, if I find another health potion, I can get a ton of max mana, ton, ton of max health, ton of something. Um, I am not blown away by the idea of getting cursed, but hey, they're not turning into statues at least, right? So another level 3 would be this person, but they've got some magic attack, which means that my physical resist is not helping me at all. Thank you. So, who do I kill? It just doesn't feel like it's going to be this guy so much. And yet, I never know if I don't try. I, also, this corrosion is not helping. Yeah, okay. I tell you what, I will region fight him until I find somebody better. Somebody better. Does that make sense? Better makes sense. I paid good money for it to make sense. Um. That's biceps and that way we're doing the most damage for our buck, you know? So he's got five tiles or something, ten tiles worth of? Yeah, five tiles worth of poison on his face. Um, if I could biceps again, I could totally just finish him off now. But it's not wanting me to, so fine, fine. We'll play it your way. Biceps again, dang it, be a chemist. Um, I don't have burn dress or anything, so this is going to be kind of an, an annoyance and a half 
But whatever. I should really be spamming biceps. It's really helping with this Yehora thing. Is that enough? That is enough, since he's low enough. I probably could have killed him earlier, but I wasn't paying attention. Oh well. Turn him into stone, please. Excellent. What's down here? Uh, I think that's like some sort of acid scroll. Um, you know what? Yeah, it's the long rent. It gives everybody on the uh, level three stacks of corrode. If I have room, I would really like to do that. I don't know though. I just don't know. Uh, oh hey, I didn't use my biceps. Cool. Um, which means I saved it for the next one. Yeah, that's not happening. It could plausibly happen in some mystical land, but not this one. Not today, not here, not now. Level fours? I don't see any level fours. Let's just, I don't know, break some walls, make some routes, make some noise. Uh, really? Well, I'm getting around town. Okay, found the, the burned as Found the plate mail. I don't remember if plate mail is that good for Gorgon, though. I don't know. It might be. It might be. I hate to waste biceps like this, but these plants have been laughing at me this whole time. I don't put up with that. Not from plants. Uh-uh. So I really might as well, and if I get mana burn, I should really destroy the mana burning plants when I'm at it. Yes. Oh, here's a level four. Um, biceps will take off a hit. That's great. Uh, Haltma will not let us do another hit. But then I get the biceps again. Ah, oh, he's probably really close. I tell you what. I tell you what. Let's let's hit a plant. A plant I don't mind hitting. That is, like this one, and ignite his burn stacks. And that doesn't put him at the fifteen percent threshold now. But recycling something would. Recycling something worth a lot of points would. I'm still saving up my money, so you know I'm not. I wish I could just buy something like this place sigil and instantly convert it. This barbing bush is confused. Which means I can kill it. <laughs> That's funny. I didn't consider that possibility before. Um, and I kind of want to hold on to all my glyphs. Biceps is actually pretty nice for the damage it adds. The Indus wall is indispensable. So I'm afraid I'm just going to have to region fight him like as was intended. I don't really care for the Witchlock pin in this case. Alright. You. Uh, help me up. Finish it off. That works. Um, now what? Well, here's a way we can go. And here's a way we can lose a ton of health. Let's go ahead and heal up some of that health back. And head around. Level 3, finding level 4s? Maybe fives? Not seeing any, so uh, move forward. Move this way. That kind of makes me feel a bit nervous. I feel like I'm getting locked in here. I'm still going to keep digging, though. Yeah. The time to maybe stop was probably a while back. The fine sword. Don't tell me not to buy the fine sword. It's a fine purchase. Hmm. Well, I'm not seeing many level 4s, but I am going to destroy the statue so that this wouldn't happen. Whatever. Just whatever. Here's a level 4. And it's Meat Man, too, so that makes him double goodness. Eat. Tasty. Words. I can speak words. Um. Kind of. I can region fight him, but where will I get the region from? I tell you what, we will destroy this plant, grab these three, and that gives me kind of a something to pull from. Um, I hate killing popcorn this early, but I really want to get rid of these curses ASAP. And that's maybe one reason not to go with the plate mills, because then they get to strike first and uh, it just sucks to be me. So now we can fight this guy a lot easier. Um, I'm going to use my help, my mana for help netting. And, you know, this extra special death gaze thing lets me finish him off. Cool. Um, speaking of, you know, killing somebody who wronged me in the past, guess who I'm thinking about destroying? You. 
So he's on fire, so he's not going to regen as much. So maybe I have a chance. Yes, I definitely do, especially thanks to Death Gaze. Um, cool. I'm going to try and knock it cursed if I can. Making it tough on me, though. Just, just saying. Just saying. What's down here? The Long Rant, that's right. I, I'm, I really like the idea of the Long Rant, but I don't want to lose my biceps or my helmet or my war garble. They just threw it at me way too early, I guess. Okay, um, level fives. Here's a level five. Two burns at this level would do 41 damage. And then I could probably death gaze him to death. Seven out of 48. I feel like that's 15% or less. And, you know, feeling like is as good as knowing for certain, right? That's the name of the game. Two. Uh, but I need the burn to res. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of... These gloves and mice are just too good. This war garble is just too good. These things all together are 20% bonus damage. I guess that's kind of something I wouldn't mind parting with too much. Nope, it's the biceps. Tell you what, one less used. See you later, biceps. Okay, now let's go back down and get the long rant, use it, and then come back up. Or come back down, yeah. Boom. Everybody should have corrosion, even the ones I haven't seen yet. So we'll pick this up, and then we'll go over here and grab those two. And now we can safely burn this guy until twice. And did 39 damage? Something's up with that. Something's up with that. Uh, how much damage are you doing, Burn? 16. Okay, so I, I was wrong. The corrosion actually brought him down that far. <laughs> Whatever. Let's stop thinking about it and just keep doing it. Um, that guy, on the other hand, I, I can kill him. Yeah, with my death gaze. I bet. So here's what I'm going to do. I need enough mana to make this work. So let's just, you know, pick up enough mana to make this work. So far, so good. Um, I only need two squares, so I'm just going to come on down here and grab them from here. Yeah, yeah. So here's the plan. Burn, burn, smack, and then the death gate should finish him off. Burn, burn, smack. Um, I'm mana burned. I really should take this opportunity to take care of these things now. I mean, this is, you know, a little excessive, I'll admit, but it's making inroads into places I want to go without me getting mana burned later. So we just gotta click very carefully. I've been killed by less. I've been killed by dumber. Um, it even corroded the mysterious Mercshade. That's excellent. I don't know exactly what that means, but that's excellent. And yeah, okay. Anything else? I know I'm not seeing that much blue, so let's finish him up with Death Gaze, which goes first, and boom. Level 5, level 5, staying alive, it's level 5. Um, we're level 5. Gorgon should be good prey for us. But do I want to burn her or heal up? I think we want to heal up. Yeah, I, I feel like that's kind of sort of working, especially since he's so poisoned now. And, um, doing 50 damage. Am I cursed for something? Because this 25% physical resist should totally make that 50 go down to 38. Oh, but I have a couple corrodes on me. Thanks, Yehora. Speaking of, I really should increase my max health. Soon. I haven't seen any health boat. Oh. Make me out to be a liar. Um, there. I guess. Let's grab a one square. I don't. I think I don't need that much health to make this work. And then I can just finish her off with my death gaze. How ironic! I don't know. I don't know what how to use the word ironic. Don't don't get on my case about that. Oh, okay. Cool. Very cool. Um, level six. Yeah, you seem like you're definitely in the runnings for me to destroy. Um, let's go ahead and burn somebody. That I plan on taking on. I'll be level six. This level seven makes sense. Do I see any level sevens? I don't see any level sevens, so there we go. Finish her off. And this is gonna be a hard one, but 
I think with two heals, I should be able to do it with Death Gaze. Yep. All right. So in a way, Gorgon's kind of like a mixture of rogue and monk. One, rogue. You get to strike first in some situations. Two, monk. You're region fighting a lot because, you know, you've got all this poison and you just want to share it with the world. Thanks. Thanks a bunch. Um, let's equalize our health and mana so we're not wasting so much. Okay. Oh, those two bosses. All right, cool. It's the sun-touched one or something. Definitely somebody I want to fight second because, you know, this guy has to come first. I don't know how we're going to take him on, by the way. I just doesn't. One thing I can tell you is that if we get enough points, conversion points, whatever, we can get death gaze, which is kind of like we're double attacking a whole bunch. All the time. Um, also, I can... I'm going to use Avatar form and reduce his resistances by like 20%, I think. Avatar form is pretty good. I like it. Now, what on earth were we doing? Um, two burns. 48 damage. Down to 41. I could definitely kill him, but then I'll be mana burned. So I'll save him for a second, maybe. Who else would be a good target, though? A level 7, yeah. Yeah, why didn't I think of that? And then we'll just kind of use healing to, you know, make him die, and then he'll regret everything he's ever done to me. And that's how that story ends. Um, heal up. Gonna have to use some of my reserve. Not that I mind. That's what it's here for. And that's all of it. A one square? Did I leave a... I did leave a one square. Okay, so... As I said, this should work. So boomity, boomity, strikity, killity. Yes. Totally. <laughs> Didn't mean for that right around, but whatever. And, of course, that, now I come across a mysterious Merkshade, whatever they're called. Level 7, so level 9 should definitely be, you know, the order of the day, I'm going to say. And, you know, I, I don't get to poison them. Not when they're undead. That's what makes undeads kind of hard. Especially zombies, because zombies are hard for their level. Didn't help that he stole some of my health, too. Uh, one more square should do it, and then I can do this. Come on down, and... Uh, I just don't feel like this is working. I have 20%, but 20% of 160 is more than a little a little less than 45 it's 32 in fact um I don't know I just don't know region fighting him doesn't seem to be working he's out regening me or something yeah yeah okay I think I, I think I just wasted a whole bunch of resources here I'm not gonna th throw waste at the wind or something like that I tell you what, though, I definitely need to go up here, and in order to do that, I'm going to have to break my way through there, so we'll do that. Is there something I can destroy to explore without getting poisoned or something silly like that? No? Wow. I mean, wow. I'm actually kind of out of darkness. Seriously. I mean, I can kill him, but then he'll turn into stone. Then where will I be, huh? Or I could destroy this thing and get two squares. That's probably going to have to be how it's going to be. And then hopefully this works. Yeah, I'm going to say it worked. I can region fight a level 8. If I can region fight. That's the question, though. Can I? Let's go ahead and just, you know, do some of this yard work. The blue bead would definitely help here, okay? That's what I'm getting at. One square. I just need one square. Without being poisoned. Or acidited. I can't get by you. You'll turn into stone. Piss off would be helpful. Alright, um, another curse. I hate getting cursed. But, you know, it, it works. Um, there. And then we'll just break this one open. And we'll start our glorious mission of killing a level 8. 
sure. He's still a lot of health. That should be level capped or something. Just saying. Make it fair for me. Um, grab this square, and I think that'll not do it. I don't want to get acided. Especially not twice. But the game's making me... We'll get cursed. Nah, I prefer acid. You know why? Because I'm going to remove all my acid with avatar form. Yes, okay. Kind of see where this is going. And I hate being cursed, but yes, I, I want to explore up here a bit. Um, heal up. Oh, I shouldn't worry about poison. I can just cure it off. Instantly. Without a problem. Okay, well, whatever. Okay. Tell you what then. Let's destroy all the poison caps. Whatever they're called. Poisonous pods. And we're just going to kind of do this a little haphazardly. Because dang it, I'm getting a little impatient with this daily. I don't think many plants drop things behind after they die, by the way. Just so you know. Um... He wasn't really in the way, but dang it, did I have it out for him. And then we'll heal the poison away. Cool. Um, what else am I going? Well, here's this. I guess since I'm level 7, I could probably try and fight one of them. Neither of them. Sure. Why not? I mean, it kind of makes sense to take him on first. How many corrosions do I have? This is going to be a tough one. Just putting that out there right now, I don't know what I'm doing. That's a lot of health he's got. I'm, I'm, I think I'll whip as him first. And then I'll try and level up Catapult off of whatever I can. And then I'll use Avatar Form or something. Um, there's still a bunch of acid guys in the way, so I think, like, once I get this ready and going, yeah, yeah, this will kind of work. Um, here we go. Let's, uh, let's grab this one square. So that way we can burn them, too. Or burn whoever we need to strike in order to keep winning at this. I might just have to use it to heal up to fight popcorn. <laughs> okay, so let's buy the whoop -as, so I can take off a full quarter of his health. That will help. That will help. I don't think I'm going to be using this. So it might be more useful as 5% more death gaze. Um, and we'll get 5% more from Davatar form, so that's great. So far. Um, I'm looking for the little... Oh, there it is. This thing. We'll buy whoop ass for 20. Totally worth it. Drink it. Boom. So that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Now let's try and level up Catapult's face. Um, kind of works. Let's turn you into stone. Turn you into stone. Can't beat him. Can beat him. The good thing about them turning into statues is that if they're, not, if they're not already in the way, then they won't be when they're turned to stone, okay? I think. That's kind of my theory, anyway. I really should have counted the EXP before doing this, but you know, I just didn't have time with all the fun stuff I have going on. Um, it would make sense to boost mana. So we're going to do that with some of the extra piety we have. Uh, boom. Alright, cool. Not that, you know, important or helpful or whatever you want to call it, but, you know, it felt like something I had to do. And... I just need five more EXP. And this guy would do perfectly. I just have to survive one of his hits, so... I hate to say it, but I'm going to have to drink a health potion just to eat popcorn. <laughs> so I can level up Catapult on the dragon. Yes. Okay, so... Kind of works. Um... Yeah, let's do this. Then heal, heal, heal. Smack him again. Now let's destroy all the acid and drink all the acid while we're at it. This this seems kinda dumb, but believe me, it's not. Maybe. 
Maybe it isn't. Uh, let's just keep up at this. I kind of wish the corrosive creepers or whatever they're called cured curse. Oh, hey, a spoon. You know what else I really wish? And something I'm going to try just to see if it works. I kind of wish, kind of hope, that Chemist has a special ability with the, uh, the acid cure thing. Did I poison him? I did poison him. I can grab this almost skill free, but I'm going to be healed up completely by avatar form anyway, so let's not. We'll save it for later. Future Captain Thief may appreciate it. Um, one of these things dropped a spoon, so I'm kind of intrigued by, you know, destroying all of them, especially to free up a little bit of piety. That's kind of something that will maybe help. Maybe. Um, any more corrosives? There's one. Oh, what I was getting at was, yes, I kind of hope that Chemist has an ability that when they drink the acid curing burn salve, that turns all the acid that they're currently holding into acid strike. <laughs> now that is massively broken and would be, you know, completely ridiculous if you ever got Earth Mother and just completely peeved her off to no end. Let's pick it up. I want it. And we'll avatar for him. Boom. There went all of my acid strikes or whatever. I only... It gave me 30%, 30 right? Yeah, okay. Um... What? Okay, Gloves of Minus has probably served its use. Let's go ahead and buy things with the thought of recycling them. Yeah, like that. This one's an interesting one, because I can use it, get a whole bunch of piety back, and then destroy it. Yeah, that's actually a pretty good deal, if you ask me. But let's see if there's something better. Fine Sword. Maybe. Fine Sword should do my whole base damage without... that completely ignores resistances, and that's kind of an interesting idea, actually. Or, Death Gates, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Um... I'm level 9, but yet this guy still kind of scares me. Okay, I have mana potions left. It may not hurt to pick them up. Considering my options, alright? Okay, so I think that'll have to do. I think I'll just fight him and try to win. <laughs> when is that never the idea? Um, alright, that kind of ends that. Let's uh, heal up a little bit. Oh boy, there's something there, and who knows what it is. It's probably the win the game in one hit button. But I'll never find it. 30% um, of 500 is 150. So he'll start taking double damage after this point. Question is, will I have the health to pull it off? And the answer is... I don't know. Not really. Yeah, he, he's kind of winning from then on. Um, something else we can do is we can use the last chance, and I don't really like the icon, but whatever. I, I don't know exactly how it works either. That's what kind of worries me. I can't get to this darkness. I can't get to... Well, I can get to this darkness. How much damage are you doing? 90? 90 whole damage to me? All right. And I can't get to this darkness. If I can kill this guy... But I need to save something for when I fight him. Because he's actually still kind of a pain. Still kind of a huge pain. Oh, right. I'm at 90% of something. Uh, Witcher Lock, not good enough. One half. That's two times my wor or the worth. Um, one, two, almost three times the worth. I think the Pin of Mana kind of wins. If I'm going to buy something just to recycle it. Especially since, you know reasons. Um, okay, so how, what we're going to have to do, unfortunately, is we're going to have to pick up mad potions just to drink them, and then use healing. It, it feels kind of dirty, I know, but it works. Alright, so we got the dragon scale that, that's worth some money. We can maybe pull this off. Um, question is, do I want to stay with Yehora? Or do I want to there actually isn't a whole lot of blood on the ground. Mostly because of all the uh, statues and stuff. There, It's in the statues, is what I, I'm trying to say. If I switched to Ben Lore and broke all the statues and then switched to Dracula, that kind of works, but I'd 
No, I don't. I don't see that working. Sorry. But he does like it when I destroy things. I just don't have enough mana left to destroy a whole bunch of statues. What I'm getting at. Okay. So here's what I'm thinking. I think we're going to buy the desecration collar, whatever it's called. Yes. And we're going to destroy altars. Kind of make them mad. And we're going to try and use it to last chance our way into beating this guy. Kind of feels like a way of doing this. Showheart, nope. Well, Showheart, maybe. Buying it just to convert it. Actually, that kind of makes some sense. Okay, I'll give it a, I'll give it a thought. And this wall, I don't think I need it anymore, so I'll recycle it first chance I get. Um, right, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and pull out this plan. Desecrate plus piety, um, and we also get some what are they indulgences? Not going to help us, but hey, they're there. I don't know why I'd want them, but I guess they're there. And we'll recycle this too for piety. Fine, I guess he didn't care. And all this rides on last chance working, and it worked. Yay! Okay, um, let's recycle into Swall. And let's recycle the Agnostic's Collar. So now I just need 25 to get to 45% death gain. That, that'd be nice. I have some money. Trollheart makes the most sense. Okay. And am I going to be burnderizing him or just helpmating myself? I feel like we're going to be helpmating because I'm going to be you know, striking him mostly. So see you later, help. Uh, see you later, Burnderaz. Okay, 50% death gates. That's really good, by the way. See how much damage I start to do toward the end there? Kind of. Kind of. We're garble, you're staying here for damage reasons. And I don't have enough money left over for fun stuff, so um, let's just pick up our mana potions and get ready to fight. Better get ready to fight. Get ready to fight. Now this is this is the beautiful part. He is weakening me with each strike, yes. But my war garble is balancing that out with its burning stacks. Is it beautiful? I think it's beautiful. Don't tell me it's not beautiful. Um, and I think we're gonna barely win here. Boom. Okay, there we go. Double strike wins the day. Um, I'm afraid of losing, so let's just uh, you know get out of here while we can. I, I will never know what that was. Somebody let me know in the comments if you find out. Victory in the Ixwamp as a Gorgon. Where am I on the leaderboards? Am I one of the few, the proud, the one to it? Darvin! Uh, now I just need a gum ball. Um, what else are we looking So I'm number two. But mostly because everyone else is still in there. They're still in the trenches, guys. I didn't, I didn't mean to hit overall. I meant to uh, hit everyone. There we go. Okay, well, he, he was pretty quick. Good luck to everybody. This one was a kind of a hard one. I barely won. Barely came up with my life. And yes, that's because I probably went with, uh, what's it called? Bet on boss instead of, I don't know, extra glyphs or something? Extra glyphs probably would have helped. Just saying. Okay, that works for me. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been Captain Thief playing the June 7th Daily Dungeon. Somewhat of a tough one. Let me know how you did. See you later.